Hey y'all, this is Autumn from Chasing Our Simple and this is day one of our sourdough starter making. Um, hopefully you've been able to gather all the things that you'll need. It's pretty simple, really. All you're gonna need is some flour, um, water, a spoon, and something to begin your sourdough starter in. So today, super simple. All you're gonna do today is take one cup of flour, all-purpose flour. I like to use King Arthur, but you use what you like. One level, if you can get it, level. cup of flour. You're going to put that in your jar, and then you're going to add one cup of water. Um, you'll want to use filtered water if you have it. If not, that's okay. I get this um, directly out of my refrigerator. There's a filter on it. Um, just so long as you don't have chlorinated water, you're not gonna want that. And then you pour that directly into your flour, and then you're going to stir it with your wooden spoon, and you're really gonna give it a stir. You're gonna stir it kind of vigorously, and it's gonna look sort of thick. I always add a little bit at a time and then pour the rest of it in at the end. And you're just going to stir that up. It might look a little clumpy. I usually go around the sides just like that. And then when you get it all stirred together, all you're going to do today is simply take a tea towel or a hand towel or whatever you have um, even a washcloth or whatever. And you're just gonna put it over the top and you're gonna sit it somewhere in your kitchen in a fairly warm spot. Um, you really kind of want your kitchen to be somewhere between 68 and 70 degrees. Um, if it's a little cooler than that, one trick that you can do is to actually flip on your oven light and place your um, jar covered inside your oven. Now make sure that you don't actually preheat your oven. You're not gonna wanna cook the starter um, or heat it up at all, but the oven light will get it, get your oven temperature just warm enough to where um, your starter will begin to do its thing. Um, and that's it. So that's all you're gonna do. Add your flour, your water, stir it up um, pretty quickly and then you're just gonna leave it. You're gonna sit it out on the back of your stove or on your counter or even inside your oven until tomorrow, until day two. Um, and then I'll show you what we're gonna do tomorrow, but that's it. That's all you do for day one. Um, and now you're well on your way to getting your sourdough starter made.